I'm Vicki Justice, Bikini Model from Miami, Florida, and today I'm going to show you a butt isolation workout that's really going to help target and build up your butt. So um, to start off, I'm going to show you a new exercise. So all you need for this exercise is a bench or something to lay on and some ankle weights. If you don't have any ankle weights, you can just start with your body weight, but as you advance, you should definitely get some ankle weights. So you're going to have one hand on the ground here and the other one holding onto the bench. And you're going to be laying like this. So you're going to put the leg out and you're just going to squeeze, lift it up, and come back down. You're going to slightly touch the ground and bring it back up. Try not to use momentum to bring your leg up, really squeeze your butt and lift it. Just lift it as high as you can until you feel your butt squeeze. So you're going to go up and down. You should really feel it working your butt. Squeeze your butt every time, go up and back down. Alright, so now we're going to do the other side. So I did 12 on that side and now I'm going to do 12 on the other side. So again, get in position, make sure that you're holding on and your hand is here. You're going to lift up, come back down. Come back down. I'm going to lift it as high as you can, really squeeze your butt. Squeeze and come back down. Try not to rest your foot on the ground too much. And really focus on using your butt. Keep going, remember to squeeze. Try to keep the rest of your body on the bench. All right, so we just did 12. For this exercise, I recommend repeating it about three times total, 12 reps each. The next exercise we're going to do is really going to target the side of our butt. So what you're going to do is you're going to lay on your side like this, holding onto the bench, and your legs straight. So you're going to lift up as high as you can, come back down. So you're going to go up, back down. You should really feel the side of your butt working. Go up. So squeeze, go as high as you can. And go slow, make sure you're doing it right. going. Do more. Alright, so we just did 12 on this side, this is 12 on the other side. Alright, so now we're going to flip over and do the same amount to the other side. So get on your side like this, holding on, and go up, squeeze, and back down. So we're doing 12 on this side also. Make sure you really focus on using your butt and squeeze. Keep your back and your abs in the same position. Just use your butt. Keep going, go as hard as you can. All right, so that was 12 on this side. So the next exercise we're going to do is one where you're going to be on the bench like this and you're going to be bouncing at the top. So this one's really great to isolate and hit your butt. So make sure your back is straight, your arms are here. You're going to lift up your leg and you're going to bounce at the top like this 20 times. So you should really feel this working your butt. This will keep bouncing. Make sure you really squeeze every single time. Keep your foot flexed. Make sure it's straight out behind you. Alright, that was 20 on one side, now let's do 20 on the other side. Okay, so now you're going to do 20 on the other side. So lift up as high as you can and bounce. Try to keep the rest of your body straight and just use your butt. Alright, that was 20. 
So we just did three butt isolation exercises, and I recommend doing three sets of each one, so that's nine sets total, and you should get a great butt workout. Once again, I'm Vicky Justice. Please like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.